Hello and very welcome to our Deepens2 tutorial series. Deepens2 allows you to design, program and visualize multimedia fountain installations in real time. In this video we would like to show you how to connect and place fountains within your Deepens2 project. Different to lighting fixtures, fountain fixtures need to be connected between each other. Here our innovative concept of dependencies is put into play. To add a fountain to the 3D world, just go to the library window, select the fountains folder and add any model you would like. In this case, we will use some classic nozzles by OAC. Place your fixture by drag and drop. The nozzle is automatically set active, so the water is pouring by default. This will make designing your fountain installation way easier from the start. In the next step, we need to add a pump to control the water output of the nozzle. Just choose your preferred model from the library and add it to the 3D world by drag and drop. Fixtures can differ in being active or passive. Our selected nozzle for example is a passive fixture, whereas the pump is an active fixture. The passive fixture is always depending on the properties of the active fixture. We also connect a fixture from the passive to the active one. For this, just select the dependency icon by hovering over the pivot, click with your left mouse button, hold it and draw a connection to your pump of choice. As soon as you have established a dependency, the water will stop pouring as the nozzle is now connected to the pump, which is your active fixture. The properties of the pump will now determine everything that will happen with the nozzle. Now switch to the programmer window. Here you can set your pump to on or off. As you change the power of the pump by manipulating its control on the left, you can regulate the water outcome. In some cases, you will need to connect a various number of nozzles to a pump. For this reason, you will need an object called distributor. At first, add more nozzles and an additional pump. Now select both nozzles and try connecting them to your pump via the dependency function. You will notice that the pump has only one connector. To connect both at once, just right click into the 3D world to open the context dialog. Here you can find the add distributor function. Now select Water Distributor. You have successfully placed a water distributor, which allows you to connect your nozzles with your pump. This is also working the other way round, as you can add another pump and connect your water distributor to it. Please notify that you always need to connect your passive fixture to your active one, as the active fixture does not come with the dependency icon. The water pressure is now divided between the two pumps and the nozzles will act accordingly to the properties of both fixtures.
to connect a various number of nozzles and pumps, you may also use the auto-connect function. The auto-connect function always will try to detect possible connections and to connect them accordingly. Add your pumps and nozzles and multi-select them with your mouse. Now you just need to click right and select the auto-connect function in the context menu. Of course, for the algorithm to work properly, you will always need to select the same number of pumps and nozzles you would like to auto-connect.